Um, well, hello from Texas. Um, I'm excited to introduce my mentee, Marina Lee. Um, she's a sixth grader at uh, Huntington Middle School in San Marino and is in the process of actually moving to Cupertino, so that's really exciting. Um, so I can't wait to hear her tell us all about uh, her project, on the, which we did in Python. Hello, my name is Marina Lee. So. My mentor's name is Ms. Jen Tannenbaum, and she works as an iOS developer at the United States Automobile Association. She also has a younger brother and enjoys playing soccer and volleyball. We have worked on Code Monkey and Code Academy before starting our project. Code Monkey is an online game that helps you learn programming. It teaches you how to write commands like counting, loops, and other functions that'll make a monkey character collect bananas. After we completed 165 levels on Code Monkey, we moved on to Code Academy. Code Academy also teaches you programming, where you only learned about lists and dictionaries. After we completed Code Academy, we used Python to make our program. My favorite part about my mentorship was learning programming one on one with Ms. Jen. My least favorite part of the mentorship was that my program was too short. I'm going to miss my weekly Sunday night meetings with Ms. Jen. My project is making a program that teaches seven to eight year olds to learn math. It includes four operations, addition, subtraction, multiplication, and division for kids to learn. You could tell the computer which operation you need help on and it will give you a problem with one dish digit. You could also earn points. You will start with 50 points, and if you get a problem correct, you would get 10 points. If you get a problem incorrect, you will lose 5 points. If your answer is too high, the program will say you guessed too high, and if your answer is too low, the program will say you guessed too low. I used a while loop to continually ask questions. I also used a random function to make the problems. I wrote all of my code in the notepad and ran it with the command prompt. Here are some samples of the program. For example, when the, pro the, when the computer asked what operation they need help on, the user typed addition and it gave a problem, seven plus seven. The person answered it correct and they got 10 points. On the other screenshot, the user answered a subtraction problem, four minus three, incorrect. The program now says you guessed too high and the player lost five points. You can try it in my demo. Overall, my experience with Git Magic was excellent. At first, it was a very different experience for me because it was my first time using video chat as a learning tool to communicate with my mentor. When Ms. Jen came to Los Angeles all the way from Texas in April, I felt honored that she would come to see me in person. We got to know each other better as we browsed through the Huntington Garden in San Marino, had robot tea, and ate dinner with my family. I would like to thank Ms. Ira Pramanik for giving girls an opportunity to learn programming. I would also like to thank my mom for finding Get Magic's mentoring program from Girl Scouts. Lastly, I would like to thank my dad and my twin sister Jacqueline for supporting me as I work on my project every weekend. Thank you for listening to my presentation.